for eight dollars though. When you sell those, those hats right there, what are you getting for? How much was he said? Four dollars. Somebody really cut the sleeves. The only t-shirt that doesn't have sleeves. That's crazy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am late. What's up, man? What's up, man? How are you? How much do you have on these ones? 40. 40? Would you do 70 if I took both? I really want 50 for them, but I'm just doing 40 for you. How much do you have on these ones? Would you do 110 for would you do 110 for these and 120? <laughs> no Thank you. Appreciate you as always. Yes, sir. Alright, kids, now we're prepared. I brought this for a reason then I left it and I forgot it. What's up, my man? What's up? How are you? Good, brother. How you been? Pretty good. You talking to Noah lately? Oh, yeah. I talk to Noah like every day. All right. Well, he was supposed to be coming up here this weekend, wasn't he? Uh, I think he was, but he he switched his plans so much that... Uh, I know. That's why I'm asking you. <laughs> Just out of curiosity, when you sell those, those hats right there, what are you getting for? Um, generally speaking, generally, for something of that quality. I think for these, like, they'll probably go for like, if I get them cheap enough, I'll just let these go for like five, these right. two, and then this one maybe like 15. Okay. So what do you consider not mid? Um, 40, 50? Yeah, like, yeah, like if I get $30 off the hat, are you coming up? Are you coming up with a lot of forty, fifty dollar hats anymore, or is that really harder to get nowadays? Mmm, definitely harder to get nowadays. Is that because everybody else is doing it, or just because the, the supply is not there? Uh, I assume that the supply is not there. Like I'll go around here, like here especially. I don't really find hats like that. Yeah, I like how you see this. This place is uh, not what it used to be. Yeah. Mm hmm. I'm supposed to go down and see uh, Noah next week. I mean, the couple times, a couple times, the one time I went, it seemed like there were some halfway decent clothes. What's up, my man? Good to you as well. How you doing? Good. You're going to be back out here and um, you're going to be setting up for this episode? Okay, uh, okay. Actually, the answer is this. I got some toys and stuff, but I'm not really trying to get rid of this thing. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay. All right. Well, every time you set up, I find something from you, so I'm looking forward to it. Well, you know what happens. I come out here and buy a bunch of stuff I don't need, and then I set up and give them away. Yeah. You know? <laughs> That's what we all do. Well, you're right here. Thank God. How you doing, man? I'm still looking, but... How much are you doing your hats for? I got these three. And then uh, how about 10 bucks for all of them? That's cool. And, well, I'm not done looking yet. I'll just let you know. But I got like a, two sweaters and a jacket right here. Florida State. Yeah. Miss. Uh, I'll do 30 for all of them. Cool? Yeah. Buddy, I hope you don't mind. Everybody that paid, I just put the money in my pocket for safekeeping. Hey. 
I'll just call you Vanessa. <laughs> okay, Vanessa. Thank you, bud. I was having a um, sweater and a uh, t-shirt. Oh. You saw I got Super Bowl hats, right? Oh, does, that, nice. does that match this? How much is that? I'll do 20. How about eight bucks? Thank you. There you go. Appreciate you. All right, thanks. How much did you have on this one? That's for 25. 25? Yeah. Are these uh, more t shirts available? Or? Uh, I just have to go through them, yeah. How much was he said? Four dollars. We finally have a sale with him. Want to keep your hanger? Uh, I think I want to make you have to break up. Big That's okay. bill. Appreciate <laughs> it. Thank you. Yep. Yeah, most of these are blank. No hookups to you. I just chopped. My first one. Somebody really cut the sleeves. The only t shirt that doesn't have sleeves. That's crazy. Yeah, a lot of them, they only need yeah, like an oxy. Water. Uh, how much were you doing on this? I'm gonna do three. Three? And this one, I'm gonna ask what you do a dollar for this yeah, one. Yeah, just a dollar on the table. Okay, cool. cool. Thank you. I mean, when it's a dollar, we can, we can put in the work. Uh, I got two on the table and one from the Bulldog. Okay. Here, five dollars ten. And I thank you very much. You thank you. Right All right, I think it's fair to say that Ramona was a W, but right now we are at the Waldo. Oh, there it is. The Waldo Flea Market. 
I can just say so far, Ramona, W. Waldo, we shall see. I have no idea if this is real or not. For eight dollars though. Yeah. I'll take your uh, coat right here. Okay. What is that? London? What is that? London Fog? Or? Nah, it's a Burberry. Oh, okay. Nice. Lord, it's hot. If you got a five and one, give me six. No, I can give you eight, I think. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, Perfect. All right. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, man. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I know what you're thinking. The spatula is here to stay. It seems like you guys really liked it. But I really feel like there's only two things to talk about at the end of this video, and that's the Burberry jacket and the hookup seat. Because these seem to sell for at least $100 to like peak 200, which they were selling for $8, which led me to be skeptical, but it ended up being authentic. So this right here is the vintage Burberry's tag. If you don't know what Burberry is, it's like a designer brand. Usually has these little plaid, plaid little patterns. Then we picked up this hookups tee. Unfortunately, it is chopped. The sleeves are no longer a part of this tee. Personally, I didn't know much about this brand or tea, but after gaining some knowledge from one of my homies, they informed me that this was an old 90s skateboard brand that was heavily inspired by anime. And let me tell you that these t-shirts are not cheap. I think just depending on the graphic, they can go for around 80 to at least 300, maybe even higher. Personally, I couldn't find anything on this graphic, but from spending $1 on this tee, I was still able to sell it for $110. All right, guys, editing fire bender here. Just wanted to let you guys know if you guys had any more information about the hookups brand, you can like place that in the comment section because once again, I am a newbie and you also might help out somebody else in the future who runs into a tee like this or, you know, yeah. Also, make sure you slap a like on the video. Um, love you guys. I'm out.